Hey guys, and welcome to the first build video of my homemade CNC. The CNC has a five foot by five foot torsion box top. This will allow a half sheet of plywood to be cut at a time and a maximum material thickness of six inches. The whole project cost under $900 to make. I have free plans to download as well as a cost breakdown spreadsheet with links to all the products I used on my website, diybuilds.ca. So without further delay, let's get started by building the table which supports the CNC and all the electronics underneath. So here you can see what the shop looks like before and after I made room for the CNC to go. The table for the CNC only uses one sheet of 5 8 MDF and one sheet of 3 quarter inch plywood. I had that sheet of plywood ripped down into smaller pieces at the big box store that I could then break on the table saw down to four and a half inches. Next it was off to the miter saw to cut everything down to exact length. If you want the exact dimensions yourself, you can go to diybuilds.ca and download a free set of plans. The legs are comprised of two pieces butt jointed together with glue, screws, and nails. To create the upper and lower shelves, I first mark out where the boards need to go and attach them temporarily with glue and brad nails. I then come back with two inch screws, two on each slat. The top of both shells, which is identical, is comprised of 5 8 MDF, 4 feet by 4 feet each. It's attached with a lot of glue, a lot of screws, and a lot of nails. The MDF was not exactly 4 feet by 4 feet, so I came back with the flush trim bit. To start attaching the legs, I first flipped over the top shelf on its top, marked out on the legs where I was going to apply glue, and then checked everything with a square before firing in a few brad nails. I then came back with four two-inch screws on each side of each leg. I cut some scrap wood spacers in order to put down the bottom shelf at the exact height that I wanted it. Now getting the shelf up here was very tricky by myself and a bunch of the spacers started falling down. So I kind of had enough of that and drove in some brad nails to keep them in place. Once the bottom shelf was sitting on all the spacers, I lifted up one side at a time, applied glue to where the thickness of that shelf was going to be, and then dropped it down again. I then drove in four two-inch screws on each side of each leg. And that's it for building the table that the CNC sits on. I just had to move it off the assembly table without killing myself and get it into the corner. Now I found out the corner is very uneven so I later shimmed three of the legs.